Now, to earlier generations, magic can only mean one thing. A funny, short-looking Yorkshireman in a wig. Sure. Getting the trade, getting round the Trade Descriptions Act by telling us you'll like it, you'll but like not it. a lot. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Today, magic is out on the street. Here to show us how streetwise it can be, would you please welcome a hit and run magician, Mr. Paul, not his real name, Zenor! Yay! All right there, Paul. Uh, Denise, okay, question well, one. You've got your new show coming out, it's Trick or Treat. It's going to be shown on Channel 4. Yep. The glorious, the glorious Channel 4. Trick um, or Treat, New Year's Eve, New Year's uh, a triumph Eve. of scheduling. Uh, what time, do you know what time it's on? Uh, I think it's 10 o'clock. 10 yeah. o'clock. Yeah. A yeah. triumph of scheduling. <laughs> <A> triumph. <laughs> it's no, called Trick or Treat. I was hoping there's a clue in the title. You, you're time thinking Halloween, aren't you? You're just trying to do that. No. Call me fickle. <laughs> yeah. OK, we've got a clip of you in action from Trick or Treat. Have, have a look at this. <laughs> I need to try to see a card, not this one. You ready? Did you get one, or was that too quick? Try again. You got one? Good. Now watch this. I'm going to try and make your card travel. Think about your card. You are ready? Take the bottom off the bottle, like that, and then screw it back on. Can I get oh, one now, yeah, please? Up you get. There we go, love. <laughs> How about I love the, the BMW gag? Uh, I Thank think you. That's because uh, we had David Blaine on the show. Uh, yeah. Who's that? He's a good. He's a good magician. <laughs> Who's? Can you say? Oh, Stary Blaine. Yeah, Stary Blaine. Oh. Right. Oh. No, he's not, he's got, no, listen, oh. I've got nothing but good. Oh, I had nothing but good things to say about him until he nicked one of my tricks last. Did, did he? Oh. Well, which trick? What did he do? He's doing it on his new special, not not the standing in ice bit. Yeah. Uh, that was, although coincidentally, you know, he did that standing in ice for. Yeah, like, go on, like, bitter. Yeah. No, no, the, the same week, right? My my central eating went off. Uh, for about two days. Right. But, you know, not as, not as good publicity-wise. <laughs> yeah, not as good, but you were, but you were still but cold. More, more, more British. Yeah. I phoned all the papers, didn't want to yeah, know. Didn't want to know about that. The, he called it um, Frozen in Time, which yeah. the, all Americans have names for the tricks. Like yeah. David Copfield does metamorphosis yeah. or whatever, which I'd have just called it something snappy like Chill Blaine. Yeah, Chill Blaine. Yeah, so that's that's a good nice and simple and effective. OK, okay. now, like most magicians, you do flashy card tricks. So we've decided to conduct this interview like one the of The cards, them. the cards, Denise. Uh, we've got these comedy sized playing cards. It says that, it says that here, oh. OK. I thought uh, I need to further oh. away than that. OK, on these comedy sized playing cards are the interview questions and three jokers. Right. Should you pick a joker, you must perform a magic trick. It's a bit for like us. Santa's stockings, our competition. It is very similar, yes. it says very similar format. Throughout that, you'll be helped by your glamorous assistant, Baby Ben. Yay! 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 <laughs> Fantastic. Yeah. Let's sit down. Say <laughs> 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 So David Copperfield gets Claudia Schiffer. All Paul right, Daniels, crew. David McGee. They're all shouting, chop him in half. Chop him in chop half. half. <laughs> chop him in right. half. Could you do that? Yeah. Okay, yeah. here we go. Paul, pick a card, any card. Denise, go right, on. Right, hang on. I need to just shuffle. Fan them out. <laughs> what? There's nothing in that, Denise. <laughs> <laughs> Unbelievable. Okay, quick. Okay, I'm just quick. This is feeling dead. Right. This is feeling like the all show's right, dying. <laughs> It's a oh, joker, joker, ladies and gentlemen. That means you've got to do a trick. Oh, oh right. OK, oh. cool. Um, cash. You've got any cash? Oh, I have it, so yeah. Five grand. <laughs> oh, someone set him up. Fantastic. Okay. All right. Have a look at that. I don't want you to think it's a fake note or whatever. I want you to stick your initials on the note, right? Mm -hmm. You can either put your baby Ben or your real name or anything. Put baby Ben. <laughs> yeah, just a big X or something like that. Now, screw it up into a little ball. OK, I'll have a pen back. OK. I bet he's already done the trick now, hasn't he? <laughs> oh, you, do you know what no, I mean? No, what we're going to do, we're going to play a little game called the Lemon Game. Have you ever heard of the Lemon Game? The no. Game? Right, can you uh, guess what it involves? Yeah. Uh, a, a lemon? <laughs> <laughs> no more clues. That's a, a little visual aid. That's a lemonade. OK, OK. Which is a crap game, but you can't think <laughs> of a better one on that point. No, it's a really bad game. Right. Come on. Okay. Okay, go on, go on. Right, what you have to do is name the word, whatever I say, just say the word lemon. Right. right. Just say whatever I, three times in a row, uh, and you win double your money. I 20 tell you quid. What, maybe we need another so, crew member here. <laughs> <laughs> this actually could challenge him a bit too much. Here we go. Right, first question. What's your name? Lemon. What do you feel right now? Lemon. Third and final question for double your money back. What would you rather win? Double your money back or a lemon? Lemon. Fair enough. Right. No, I'll tell you what, take the tenor. <laughs> <laughs> well, do the tenor. Right, what were your initials again? Ben. Ben, were your initials? What's that? No, I won't. Ben on it. OK, what's on there now? PZ. PZ, which is actually my initials, which is any court Whoa. in the land will tell you. How that happen? That makes that technically and legally <laughs> mine. Yes. Yeah, However, can I just say, I think when you took the lemon out of your pocket, you just switched the thing. Oh. Don't do that. Oh. Don't deconstruct. Oh. Right, well... Oh. I don't think so, because there's his lemon there. Oh. His money. No, it's easy. <laughs> 
No, that is not easy, Denise. <laughs> if this is... Uh, <laughs> Denise, you don't seem to realise that I have a rather sharp knife. <laughs> easy. Never easy. threaten easy. Never wow. threaten wow. Is that the one? Wow. That is wow. the one. No, that is very good. Wow. Wow. It's magic. Yeah. Thank you, Paul. Let's ask you, Paul. Yeah. Was, that act was that actually magic? I mean, can you read minds and I, stuff like that? Yeah. Um, right, write, write down a number. I'll write down a number. Write down a number. Right, 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 <laughs> That's a show, the mind of Donna Air. <laughs> okay, let's crack on. Let's have another question. Okay, no, let's, 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 do you know what? I've lost the will to live. Yeah, I'm so yeah, no, I think we all have. I'm so right. You're not. Yeah. You, Donna, believe okay, me. Okay, we you're have not. a question for you. Donna, I know you're not right. I'll tell you why afterwards. <laughs> <laughs> okay, how did How did you kickstart your career, Paul? Um, I started as a, as a street performer. Let years me tell ago. you a bit about and, my background. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. I thought I was an accountant. <laughs> um, <laughs> <laughs> I just all I wanted to do was sing. Uh, but uh, no, I started off as a street performer, and then yeah. ended up supporting rock bands on tour. I supported a band called Hawkwind. Oh, oh, oh fantastic! Oh, I, I just oh, took a ride. Yeah. So you used to be like just, a warm up. Um, <laughs> something like that. I was. Uh, I did this gig at Hammersmith Odeon. I had to open up for them, and they brought the safety curtain down behind. I yeah. did my bit. And as I finished the idea, the curtain went up and they came out. Nice. And unfortunately, it didn't come up. And now the safety curtain seals off the front of the theatre, right. so I couldn't get off. So I finished my spot and I've got 5,000... Metlers. Um, yeah, metlers. And I go, thanks, and I had to jump in at the orchestra pit. Nice. That's and that's the origin of stage diving. There yeah. we go. <laughs> <laughs> OK, pick a card, any card. Right. Another question. OK. okay uh, then we'll go when did you perform your first trick? Uh, let's go to a joker. <laughs> Not the joke, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, cool. Uh, more cash. I've got, uh, got my own cash. Climb inside there and have a look around, make sure there's no one hiding. All right. What we're going to try. Uh, this is gotcha, kinda... Mike. Go to the news after this, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> no, Mike was just giving me messages. Okay, cool. Right, if you hold on to those, right, nice and tight, dead, dead straight like that. I bet right. he's done the trick already, hasn't he? It's already done now. No, I haven't. There's a, there's a pair of scissors here. Okay. Uh, right, hold him dead straight, right? Don't let go. Right, now, dead. Tight together. Ben, okay, do it properly. Oh, right now, watch this. Now I'm going to cut those in half. How about Dan? Now ben I don't want anyone saying later that I didn't cut through the notes. Okay. Right? Ben and Donna, do a show. We got that. <laughs> now, now this is the weird thing. Two lots of twenty makes forty. Fantastic. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Cut in half <laughs> makes four lots of ten, and as I say, four lots of ten makes round about. <gasps> yeah. Come on, that's good. That's good, Ed, because you're a cynic, and that was good. <laughs> You're a cynic that is really who hates good. magicians, generally. <laughs> <laughs> you hate magicians. No, you told know. me you can't stand no, them. No, because that was you said this is magicians. I don't know. Yeah, 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 it's a fact. OK, one last trick. Yeah! yeah. 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 And then, can we have a question? Oh, God, Donna. Can okay. we have one question as well? What has been the most spectacular trick you have ever performed? Um, I once managed to um, sleep with this woman who was in a film. Oh, yeah. Yeah. No, she was in a film. Ladies and gentlemen, yeah. Paul Zenon. Yeah. We'll come back, we'll do another trick before the end, because right now, uh, the producer's going... Uh, my producer's going bad, because we've got to go to uh, Jasmine Lowe's from the Big Breakfast News and Weather. But you've been Paul Zenon, and it's been fantastic to have you on the show. Yeah. Right, James? Yeah.